First, the brother of a murder victim may have found a key piece of evidence after Austin police overlooked it. It was a big enough discovery to lead to an arrest nearly a month after the murder. Chris Sodegi is live at the Cameron Green's apartments on Cameron Road with what was found. Chris? Well, they arrested the suspect by a fingernail, literally. It was a fingernail that had been torn off and left inside the victim's car, but police did not find it. It wasn't until they gave the car back to the family that they discovered the evidence that was very small, yet very big. Last month, police were looking for this man. It's who they believe killed 19-year-old Reynaldo Ortega and critically injured another man in two separate and random robberies in the parking lot of the apartments where the men lived. Now it's another case that appears to have been cracked by DNA. The CODIS hit that we got that helped us break the case open actually came from a torn fingernail. The DNA on the fingernail matched the profile of Drexel Washington, who was already in jail for an arrest a week later and who was a suspect in a robbery in the same area in 2010. But back to that fingernail, it was found inside Ortega's car where he was robbed, but not right away. The detective had missed it at the time and didn't see it. It wasn't until after the car was released back to the family that Ortega's brother found it, realized it wasn't Ortega's, and called police back. A big break that erased a big mistake. It is a little bit worrisome that we missed it, but, you know, we've, we've learned from it and we, we won't make that mistake again. And ironically, police went back and looked at crime scene pictures that they took inside the car. And in those pictures, the fingernail is visible. So it's not something that would have been planted after the fact. They also say that Washington matches that description of the sketch and also that shadowy figure captured on the surveillance cameras. We're live in Central Austin. Chris Sadegi, KXAN News.